This is a map I use to show where in the world people commenting on my videos are from, until recently when I found it had a fundamental problem. But now finally, I think I found a solution. Welcome back and it's your first time watching one of our videos and it's fantastic to have you here. Every time somebody makes a comment on one of my videos and leaves their location, there's a chance I might pin them on the map. As I have with hundreds of other people across the world, but recently this has become a problem. And it's a problem I saw coming because while it may be fairly easy to pin people scattered around places like Australia, Africa, South and North America, like the Krillman experience in Coma, Georgia in the United States, it just wouldn't be possible to jam all those pins into the United Kingdom and Ireland here. And that's why there's a separate United Kingdom and Ireland map for people like Sean in Fermanagh in Northern Ireland. But while I'm getting all these comments from the UK and Ireland, I'm getting nearly as many from this region over here. From Afghanistan, through Pakistan, India, Nepal, and even into Bangladesh. And the problem is, I simply can't put all those people on the map. There's just too many pins there already. No matter what I do, it just won't go in there. Not leaving a nearby city or town is a problem as well, because a country is a big place, but the main problem is I needed a new map. And I wanted to do this ages ago, but surprisingly it's not that easy to find a map of the Indian subcontinent on the internet. I did find some maps of India itself, but nothing including all the countries I needed. And the few I did find were 50 to 100 years old, which would also have been no good. And I had the bigger problem that I had nowhere to put this map. You would have seen in recent videos all this stuff that had to be moved out of the way. But this is what I found, and I'm fairly happy with it. It's just an ordnance survey map, which is why it's so big. The lines are a little bit difficult to see, and it's a little bit tatty around the edges. But once I get some decent lighting sorted out for it, it's definitely going to be good enough for what I want to do with it. And there's loads of room for more pins. Which is great because I'm no longer forced to ignore these people and I can pin even more in the majority of Afghanistan, Pakistan, Nepal, Bangladesh, Sri Lanka and India, such as Bavik from Mumbai. Which is when I noticed an issue with buying a map that's 25 years out of date. Also in India we've got Devanshu in Lucknow who says these videos are helping him stay sane in lockdown. Speaking of which... If you're having trouble with this yourself, why not have a go at our quarantine trick shot challenge? It's a trick shot without any form of table. But Shafula from Kabul, Afghanistan thinks we should be doing a lot more head cam videos and I see a lot of you agree with that. So it's definitely something I'm going to be looking at in upcoming videos. And I might do something along the lines of a remember what it actually felt like to play snooker video. So if you think this is a good idea, just hit the like button and I'll get onto that in the next week or so. But first, let's do a high speed fill up of this new map. Starting with Pratik in Kathmandu, Nepal. And Saeed from Dakar, Bangladesh. It looks like we need more comments from Bangladesh if that's where you're watching from. Ramel from Karachi in the south of Pakistan. Abbas Haider, who's from Hyderabad in India. Also coming to us from India, we have Amar in Delhi. And I hope all you guys in that area are doing all right at the moment. Khaled, who's from Saihit, Bangladesh. And now we're going to find Zain in Abbottabad, Pakistan. Back over to Afghanistan now with Mr. Rafiki, who's in Kandahar. So we're making a fairly good start on this map and we're now making it even better with Jitendra, who's in Jaipur, India. And finally for now, Musa, who's in Lahore, Pakistan. So this is the update to the room. We've got a lot more space and as you can tell, it looks a lot better to what it used to. However, you may not live in the specific Southern Asian region we were looking at today. Well, that doesn't matter because Europe's getting awfully full and I've just noticed we've got an awful lot of wall space. We've also got more videos coming up in the near future to help you through lockdown, like our quarantine snooker trick shot video. So remember, don't just watch, play, and make the commitment to becoming a better player by subscribing to the channel and visit the website. See you later.